All right, Onks friends. Um, a couple years ago, I did a, a blog post on my website talking about humble beginnings, uh, where I started my business. And so if you want to visit that on our website, onkswscom I talk about my first shop that I put together in Savannah, Georgia. But uh, currently, my family is on vacation um, in Tybee Island, and I wanted to come and visit my repair friends that I used to work with uh, where I started repairing almost 20 years ago at Portman's Music in Savannah, Georgia. And so um, I am here now, and I just want to show you around the shop, uh, show you exactly where I got my start. Um, humble beginnings, did not know anything about what I was doing about anything, uh, but I was uh, hired by the great repair guy, man, uh, Sheldon Canis, and he uh, uh, mentored me and showed me basically everything I know. And uh, so, be right back with you. I'm gonna show you around the shop. All right, so here is the main hallway with all the rental uh, instruments. That is amazing. And uh, when I worked here, we ran all of these before they would go out for rentals and for sales for school. This is the shop entrance here. So this is where I got my start. Uh, the great Sheldon Canis, his office was here. And he worked in here um, and managed the shop. There's another bench, uh, former colleague, uh, Tony, worked here when I was here. Um, tons of uh, supplies and tools. Uh, here's a computer station that we would use to update our tickets and whatnot. I'm not sure if they still have the same process, but uh, that's what we did then. And then right beside the computer station, this, ladies and gentlemen, was my very first bench. Uh, it is now, uh, it's probably been used as a bench since I left, but uh, currently it's a storage place for lots of clarinets, it looks like. Um, but when I first started working here, my first weeks and months on the job, Sheldon Canis brought me about, oh, I would say at least 50 uh, clarinets, and he said, overhaul these. <laughs> so that's what I did. I got down to work and started overhauling clarinets. Um, lots of more parts and supplies, another workbench. This is the grizzly, grizzly lathe that I learned how to do everything that I know how to do on. Um, anything like uh, tenon replacements. Um, nowadays we do a lot of tone hole replacements. So I learned how to uh, turn materials and um, use a lathe. That's where I learned to do that on that great machine there. And then on the back side of that machine, uh, there's a really old uh, lathe and so this is where I learned to spin all of our tenon corks um, When we replace tenon corks, so they're all nice and uniform and beautiful And so that's where I learned that process Right there and we still do that in our shop today um, And then right behind that is another work area which I actually occupied uh, the last couple years that I worked here So I would work over here uh, knocking out clarinets and flutes and bassoons and bass clarinets and saxophones. We did it all. Um, and I'll have to say that uh, I definitely learned a ton working here, uh, servicing all of those instruments for sure. Um, then back around here, there's more uh, cabinets and supplies, uh, but this is the case repair area. So anytime there was a damaged case, uh, we would repair the latches and the hinges and then in here we would do all the washing of the instruments look at that very large ultrasonic machine you can put uh, tubas and everything in there so we would do that so uh, that was a quick tour of the repair shop at Portman's Music uh, is extremely valuable for me and um, just want to encourage all of you guys out there uh, when you're starting something um, that you just have to start and doing great work is not um, 
it's not a mark or it's not a customer it's not all these things that we build our build up in our minds uh, just great work is is showing up and doing diligent work every day and then ultimately uh, to serve our customers to the highest degree and so no matter where you start whether it's in a music store or if you get, uh, get your first job playing in a symphony um, all of all of those steps in your life are very important and you should not take them for granted so just a little encouragement from from me to you today i uh, hope you guys are are working hard and enjoying your life um, so thanks for tuning in and um, look forward to uh, sending you guys more content uh, pretty soon so just start begin and um, great things will come later down the road take care